Kingdom greetings to everyone listening to this audio. My name is Pastor Marco. Ndichaveringa shokura mwari from the book of Jeremiah chapter number 5, verse number 22, part B. I have placed the sand as the boundary for the sea by a perpetual decree that it cannot pass beyond it. And though its waves toss to and fro, yet they cannot prevail. Though they roar, yet they cannot pass over it. May God bless the reading of his holy words. Musoro we shokora nas unoti perpetual decree. Kanandichiti perpetual decree, jino leva chirevo chisinga peri. Chirevo chisinga expire. Chirevo chiri eternal. Chirevo chiri everlasting. Muscripture ya taveringesa. Mwarivari kutindaka ita jecha kutirive mugano we gungwa. Nikatema chirevo chisinga peri. Kuti gungwa rirege kudarika mugano we jecha. Mafungu anga fashama. Asi anga kundi. Anga virima. Asi anga udariki mugano uyu. Ladies and gentlemen. Though the ocean may be more powerful than the sand. But God put a perpetual decree in the sand that it would keep the ocean in its boundaries. The ocean may roar with its waves. Gungwaringa popota negufashama. But because of God's perpetual decree, the sand will not be overpowered. Any area that you are struggling with, I encourage you to find the scriptures that you can stand on. What Anga could declare. It is more powerful to say what God says about you. Declare his promises. Speaking what God says about you. Uchibuda mumba mako. Declare uti. I can do all things through Christ Jesus who strengthens me. Declare uti. I am blessed and cannot be cursed. I will live and not die. Ukadaro, just like that sand, God will push back the ocean. He won't let that obstacle defeat you. Even Jesu paka yezu wana satani murenje. I quote a scripture. Achidi jaka nyoru wa When you are in difficult times, do not just say what you feel or what you think or what you want. But rather say what God says about your situation. Shokora mwari rine simba. God put a perpetual decree in the sand. In other words, mwari vaka isa shokoravo, mutsanga yega yega ye jecha. Shokorini mujecha, rinopa jecha the ability to keep the ocean in its boundaries. Ukatarisa nezi sore nyama, the ocean is massive and powerful. The sand is tiny and is nothing compared to the ocean. But the tiny sand holds the ocean in its place. Oh, because God put the perpetual decree in the sand. Nika kutari sa unenge jecha. Shirikuru wa newe may look bigger and more powerful. But usachka as long une shokura mwari mumoyo mako. The word of God in your heart is the perpetual decree that enables you to withstand storms that are stronger. The word of God in your heart is the perpetual decree that enables you to overcome enemies that are bigger. And to accomplish dreams that seem impossible. Ukaveringa Isaiah chapter number 55 verse number 11. Shokwari not God's word will not return void. In other words, it will not be ineffective. When you have God's word coming out of your mouth, you cannot be defeated. When you declare what God said, you are activating the word. And the word will take you where you can't go on your own. God will open doors for you. He will do what medicine cannot do. You will defeat enemies that are much bigger. Satan nema dimoni ake. Ano gona kukuzeve zera in your mind. Kuti look at the medical report. He will never get well. Ano gona kukuzeve zera in your mind. Kuti we have been single all these years. He will never get married. You know father good Ephesians chapter number 4 verse number 27. He not give no place to the devil. Now you so good do not let the devil fill your mind with the thoughts of defeat, lack, and insecurity. But it a counter by declaring the word of God. God's word is like a seed. Usaneta, but keep declaring it. 
it will grow and become what God promised. The Bible says in Acts chapter number 19, verse number 20, so mightily grew the word of God and prevailed. Ladies and gentlemen, his word will prevail over sickness. His word will prevail over fear and depression. The word of God will prevail over every difficult circumstance. Though the ocean may be more powerful than the sand, but God put a perpetual decree in the sand that it would keep the ocean in its boundaries. Gungwaringa popota, chelorika zara sei, rino ziva peko gomira. Harifera kadarika muganu, because of God's perpetual decree in the sand. You are tiny and nothing compared to the challenges you are facing. But because of God's perpetual decree over your life, you are an overcomer. This is a new day. God is doing a new thing in your life and in your family. That setback is not there to stop you, but it is there to promote you. What God put in your heart will still come to pass. The dreams he has given you will still be completed. I decree and I declare that whatever has been hindering you is about to go back. Every mountain shall be brought low. Every valley shall be lifted. Every crooked way shall be made straight. Problems that look permanent are about to be resolved. Your healing is coming. Your promotion is coming. Your freedom is coming. Your destiny is inevitable. In Jesus' mighty name, God bless you.